Outside McClellan Park, President Trump supporters welcome the California visit, lining the entrance off Watt Avenue down Peacekeepers Lane, awaiting Air Force One touchdown. But there are also demonstrations against the president's visit. And at times, both would mingle side by side at moments, exchanging in dialogue that at times was passionate, but not violent or physical by any means. But when demonstrators began marching around McClellan Park, there were moments where exchanges became dangerous. Off Dudley Way, outside the VA hospital, a crowd of demonstrators were on the shoulder of the street, and a Volvo station wagon swipes the crowd while driving away. The window of that Volvo was broken, and there was glass on the asphalt. We saw one person being loaded up into an ambulance for their injuries. Shortly after, as the march continued onto Palm Street, outside the VA outpatient clinic, a driver was trying to get through demonstrators, pushing through with their red truck and continuing despite being surrounded by people. We didn't see an ambulance at this scene and are unsure if someone was seriously injured. The march then continued onto Watt Avenue, northbound lanes blocked by demonstrators. At one point, a CHP unit moves to leave the area and a demonstrator gets on the hood. The CHP driver continues and the man goes over the unit, hitting the ground. Demonstrators carry that man onto the grassy shoulder at Ruth Inman Park, where he was later taken away by an ambulance. It's important to know that the marching we were following was one of multiple demonstrations and rallies, a strong showing both for and against the president. At McClellan Park, Vicki Gonzalez, KCRA 3 News.